Oh, I hate intros. That's Don't my least favorite it. part. You could again. you could do it. So we're here with Michael Shemto. Good morning. Lisa. Good morning. I'm so happy that you're here. Uh, the Daily and Butcher Bee are two of the restaurants that we frequent the most, and you're here to teach us about the breakfast pita. Yes. So let's talk about how to make this. We're gonna start step one: make a cucumber and tomato salad. We're gonna use uh, about half a lemon to season it. We're gonna add some olive oil and salt. Good? Mm -hmm. Great. I'm really good. All right. So let's assemble everything that we're gonna need. So I'm just gonna encourage you to add it. <laughs> use the kind of things that you have in your house. Perfect. So if you got some nice radishes, great. Um, you got cherry tomatoes, that's fine. Instead of cucumbers. Cool. You don't have tahini, but you have hummus in your fridge. Whatever, you can sort of make this your own. All right, we're ready to cook our eggs. Yay! We have our pitas, yes, which are beautifully charred. Nice charred oh, for you. So good. We're gonna cut it right around there. It gives you a nice little thing to snack on. First thing we're gonna do is on this thicker part, gonna line that with tahini. Next, we're gonna want to put something that's gonna absorb all the liquid and the juice and okay. the dressing. So for oh us, it's gonna be this lettuce. And then we're gonna kind of layer the next few things in there. So we'll put some salad in. Yum. Then we'll grab some of our eggs. Mm -hmm. And then we'll put a little bit of uh, spud. In. And then we'll do tahini and a couple of radishes. So you're just sort of stuffing it all in. Mm -hmm. And the more layers, the more love. So use this little end, stand it up. <laughs> you and Will should, uh, should bite it. Yeah, yeah. Come on, Will. Mm. We're gonna be eating this every day now. <laughs> it's amazing. It is so good. Lucy, thanks Seriously, for Seriously, thank me you out. so much for coming. Yeah, this is part of my heritage and, um, and part of my sort of story of growing up. So thanks for giving me a chance to make it with you. And we're making it a part of our family tradition now too. Aww. Because definitely um, our children are going to grow up eating a that. lot of breakfast pitas. <laughs> thank you so much my for pleasure. coming.